Welcome to Easy Microbiology. Welcome everyone. We are here to discuss the general theme of Mycobacterium bovis and how it impacts our communities. We will look at the current challenges and explore potential solutions together. Let's get started. Yeah. Bovis is a pathogenic bacteria that can cause tuberculosis in cattle, humans, and other animals. It is a gram-positive organism and capable of withstanding long-term environmental stress. Under a microscope, M. bovis appears as single, free-floating organism with a distinctive morphology. It is considered to be a major contributor to human and animal TB cases in certain parts of the world. M. bovis is a bacterium that is present in the environment, typically in soil, water, or vegetation contaminated by animal feces or respiratory secretions. It is also able to survive in unpasteurized milk and dairy products, making it important to be aware of the potential risks of consuming food and drink that has not been adequately prepared. M. Bovis has a resistant outer capsule created by mycolic acids which is composed of various long-chain fatty acids. It measures 2 to 4 microns in length and 0.2 to 0.5 microns in width. It also features liporabinamanin, a complex glycolipid that is indispensable for the survival of the bacteria. Mycobacterium bovis is a species of bacteria that has some very specific cultural characteristics that need to be accounted for in order to cultivate it. As it grows slowly, Lowenstein Jensen agar or Middlebrook 7H11 agar must be used. M. bovis also prefers an environment with low oxygen and high carbon dioxide concentrations in order to develop properly. Biochemical Characteristics M. bovis is an obligate aerobe that is catalase positive and produces niacin. It is also resistant to theophene 2 carboxylic acid hydrazide, TCH. M. Bovis is a bacteria that is capable of infecting a wide variety of animals, such as cattle, deer, buffalo, badgers, and even humans. Its host range is amongst the broadest of all bacteria, which indicates its remarkable ability to adjust and persist in a variety of climates. M. Bovis is an important pathogen with virulence factors enabling it to cause disease in humans and animals. Of particular note is its waxy capsule, which helps shield the bacterium from phagocytosis. Furthermore, M. bovis produces enzymes and proteins that can damage host tissues and allow it to evade the host's immune system, allowing it to cause serious harm and spread the disease. M. bovis, a bacterium, is characterized by its thick outer capsule, making it resistant to many antibiotics. Its adaptability is further augmented by genetic mutations and the acquisition of resistance genes, creating a challenge for treatments and leading to the spread of antibiotic resistance. Epidemiologists have discovered that Mycobacterium bovis is mainly transmitted through direct contact with diseased animals or the ingestion of contaminated dairy items. The bacteria is more frequent in developing countries, yet instances have been reported in several regions globally. Bearing this in mind, it is essential to handle food correctly, be conscious of food sources, and particularly be aware of animals that may be in danger of infection. M. Bovis is a bacterium responsible for causing TB, a highly contagious illness. It develops and expands inside of host cells, mainly in the lungs. Other organs may become targets for infection prompting more severe signs in the risk of fatality if it remains untreated. TB is a disease that can be both prevented and treated, making early recognition and management essential. Immune responses to M. bovis are predominantly cell-mediated, involving the cooperation of specialized T cells and macrophages. The wax capsule that these bacteria form can impede the body's immune response, making a chronic infection more likely. To counteract this, various treatment strategies have been developed to better facilitate the body's immune response to M. bovis. Once these strategies are applied, the body can more efficiently eliminate the bacteria and restore health. The diagnosis of M. bovis infection can be complex. 
A combination of clinical signs, imaging studies, and laboratory testing is typically necessary to make an accurate diagnosis. Culture and PCR analysis of sputum, blood, or other body fluids may be conducted to further identify the infection. Proper hygiene and sanitation practices on dairy farms, as well as the pasteurization of all dairy products, are key to preventing infection by Mycobacterium bovis. Vaccines are also available to protect cattle from this infection. This photo is licensed under the Creative Commons Attribution No Derivatives License. Treatment. Treatment of M. bovis infection typically involves a combination of antibiotics, such as isoniazid and rifampin, for several months. However, antibiotic resistance is a growing concern, and treatment may be challenging in some cases. Conclusion. M. bovis is a pathogenic bacterium that can cause TB in humans and animals. Its unique waxy outer capsule makes it resistant to many antibiotics and allows it to evade the immune response, leading to chronic infection. Prevention and control of M. bovis infection require a multifaceted approach, including proper hygiene and sanitation practices, pasteurization of dairy products, and vaccination. Thank you for your attention.